Les gars qui rentrent. Hein. Ni pinga. I bet this fucking boat will sink halfway to Miami. I never seen anyone fight like you, Danny. You left those ships burning wrecks. Come on, I had help. Glad I quit the military before you came along. Get your pestles ready. Got what you need. Straight from the black market. Your voice? It doesn't matter. I am Clara Garcia, and I hear you. Libertad hears you. And we won't stop fighting until every... My best customer. You need supplies. You need to talk to me. Ese pum pum girl. I think of myself as a second hand killer. Danny, back for more chaos, I see. Killing is art and science.
Some call it a Hawaiian shirt. I prefer guerrilla tuxedo. Ah, my favorite guerrilla. So many fun ways to... Get your pestle ready. Hell of an office one. All right, let's work. Want me to make you the best supremos and resolver weapons? You need depleted uranium. Lucky for you, Castillo has stashed his supply with the biggest guns on the island, his anti-aircraft cannons. When you got some of that sweet uranium, you can bring it back to my office or to one of my associates. If you capture an FND base, a member of Team Juan will move in and give you access to my inventory. And don't forget, rank has its privileges. When Clara is kind enough to promote you, we'll be able to hook you up with better gear. Just have those pesos ready. Even in revolution, nothing comes free. And here's some advice, guerrilla to guerrilla. Have some fun for fuck's sake. Die with a smile on your face. You'll be back. They always come back.
Hey, Danny, can't spell weapons without workbench. So, Juan, why do you trust me with all your creations? You barely know me, Aceri. An instrument crafted by a master must be played by a virtuoso. I have seen the way you play, Danny. You're like Stravinsky on Adderall. You have a gift. Gracias. But I would rather have a gift for escaping this island. Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Cause you was surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. I can leave any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Let's free Yara, shall we? Castile controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. But most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximas Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, we have Castillo's nephew, Jose, a slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Philip Barzaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we got Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm going to get all these groups to sign up to Libertad by myself? How? Simple. You help. Any way you can. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you, they get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Then he needs a walk. Viva Libertad, Efa! Yeah, yeah. I'm not Clara's best guerrilla. You are. You're not listening. Translate one. The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich. From a family of true Yaren she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants, but she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor, from the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See? And you're using her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? See? You want to free Yara? Sure you do. But here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush, 
The smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... It's... It's fun. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. Danny, let's do business. The least I could hope for was a good meal. So what was the problem then? Gators too. Again, you can't expect a guerrilla to eat the same fucking thing every day and remain vigilant on his four daily patrols. Oh, it's four now? Next you'll be there and you kill the whole battalion with your bare hands. Maybe I could if I wasn't so hungry all the time. I'll catch some fish on my next patrol if it all shows you off. <laughs> 